Hey what's going on guys, welcome back to our video. Today's video we're going to be taking a closer look at the Five Tall Tales Randolph Scott Western box set. This is released by Indicator Films. Um, it consists of five westerns that Randolph Scott did with director Bud Boyager. Uh, this was when they were both at Columbia Studios. Uh, they did two more westerns uh, but not for Columbia so they're not included in this set. This is a limited edition set. Um, it's limited to 6,000 copies. I got number 2,034. So yeah, let's take a closer look. So right off the back comes with a nice J card, which just comes nicely off the set there. So here it is. So you've got the indicator logo at the top. Tells you the years varying for the film's releases and it tells you all the different movies that are included in this set. Same thing on the side. Here on the back you've got all the movie posters for the films and it gives you a kind of synopsis about what are the films and it gives you your limited edition number. Uh, and then it's got here on the back some quotes from filmmakers. So you've got Sergio Leone saying that he uh, stole everything from him inspiration-wise. So yeah, very nice uh, little J card there. So we take a look at the actual box set itself. Uh, we've got Randall Scott there. Um, that is from the Tall T, that poster art. Very, very nice. Spine it continues wrapping around. Very nice. So this is indicators um, releases number 62 to 66. Uh, on the back, unfortunately, this is the only downside. This is printed onto the actual hard box itself. Um, but yeah, basically it comes with a bunch of extras there. I'm not gonna read them, unfortunately, sorry. Uh, but you can pause if you want to read those. Um, but they come with 2K restorations. And there is all the specs for the films. So you got Tall T from uh, 1957. Decision at Sundown from 1957. Buchanan Rides Alone from 1958. Ride Lonesome from 1959. And Comanche Station from 1960. They are all in colour as well. So very, very nice. And then here's the other side. This is where all of the Blu-rays are housed and you get a booklet as well. And there's the top. You got all the movie titles there. And then on the bottom, you got the age rating and a couple credits as well. All right guys, so if we start off with the booklet, I'll show you in detail the booklet. So very, very nice. There is the director on the back. It's quite a nice thick booklet actually. So here we go. So I won't flip through every single page, but you know, you get the general idea of the booklet. Very, very nice. So that basically tells you everything about each film in this booklet. So you got the Tall T. Great, great movie as well. Very iconic um, picture there of Randolph Scott. So yeah, some nice essays and reviews of the film, some nice pictures. So as you can see they do go into detail for each movie and it's not rushed or very brief, it's quite detailed. You got Decision at Sundown.
you know, Buchanan rides alone. Gives you all the information as well, as you can see, about the film. It's very nice paper quality as well, it's not cheap. It's very, very nice, kind of glossy finish on it. You got right lonesome. Comanche Station, which is personally my favourite of the five films you get. Nice green colour for this one. And then you got Seven Men from Now. Interview with Burke Kennedy. There's the director himself, who directed all the movies. Okay, and some nice behind the scenes images. Now our interview. films were made for Blu-ray. Very, very nice. So there is the very nice booklet. Here we have the first film, which is The Tall T. Very nice vintage artwork there. Uh, now what they did for these releases is because there's five films, two of the cases have got two films in them. So yeah, and that gives you a breakdown of the extras uh, for each individual film. And then on the inside, and these are all region free, might I add as well, just in case you want to import. And on the inside, you've got the discs, so you've got Decision at Sundown. And then there's the Tall T. And then they do give you artwork for Decision at Sundown. So you can swap that out if you prefer it. So very nice artwork, even if it's for a different film. So there's the tall T. Here we have Buchanan Rides Alone with the original artwork. This one is paired up with Ride Lonesome. Here's the special features. There we go, and again, region free. So, very similar to this, the, the last one. You got disc artwork for Buchanan Rides Alone. And then you got Ride Lonesome. And again, very nice artwork for Ride Lonesome. So there is Buchanan Rides Alone. And the last one is Comanche Station, which gets its own case. Luckily for my favourite one. <laughs> So I love that poster art. Again, there's the special features. And again, region free. So there is the disc artwork. And again, they still give you different artwork. So if you want to change the artwork out, you can. I believe the US release of this film did have this artwork also. So there we go. 
Alright guys, that's it for this video today. I hope you did enjoy. If you did enjoy, hit that like button. It really shows your support for the channel. Uh, I'll maybe make some closer looks if this one gets a good feedback. Hit that subscribe button if you are new around here for more Western talk here on this channel. And until next time guys, as always, take it easy, stay awesome, peace.